Oh, I am Jake. Um, I had a, um, a leaf barrier outside before. Could be noisy with the, um, the recording of this video, but, um, keep it in the minds. Um, this video is talking about the the 2020 ACT election last Saturday, um, um, I just write down, um, the votes and the percentage of the votes for is, I only talking about the major political parties, Labour, Liberal and the Greens, and for the city of Jinadala, the Boko Party. The other parties are pretty much under 2% two, two or under and is in by, is, uh, not worthy to talk about it. But, um, I, I just write down from the ACT elections website, um, about the this um, information is not the final result for this election, but um, it is the most up up to date um, results for the ACT election. And then I talking about my res uh, regressions of the election result, but. Just talking about the major totals of the major political parties. For the total, um, Labour got 97,344 votes. That is not final. And they got 38.1% of the vote. Is done zero point. 3% I write it down but could be updated um, soon. The Labour Party got 85,266 votes, 33.4% um, and let down 3.3% from the last election. Um, the Greens got 34,891 votes, 13.7%, and got a string of 3.4% of the vote. For each seat, um, I write it down in the book. Seat of Bimbabala, um, Labour got 24 2,153 votes. Um, percent of the vote is 40.8%. And the quota rate is 2.4 of the quota and a swing towards them of 7.2%. The Labour Party got 27,831 votes, vote set of 38.4% and the quota is 2.3 of the quota and the swing against the Liberal Party in the city of Bimbabala is 3.5%. The Greens got 5,850 votes, um, got 10.8% of, of the set of the vote, they got 0.6% of the quota, and the swing towards the Greens got 5.7% in the set of Bimba Bala. For the set of Jinadala, um, the Labour Party got 21,357 votes, got a vote set of 40.4%, a 
quota of 2.4 got a swing against um, the Labour Party of 0.9% from the last election. The Labour Party got 30, 13,865 votes, 26.2%. The vote sale, 1.6 of the quota, a swing against the Liberal Party in Guinea Dollar of 5.8%. The Greens, they got 6,750 votes, 12.8%. The vote sale in Guinea Dollar, 0.8 of the quota, and a swing towards the Greens in Guinea Dollar. 3.1%. For a other party only contest the set of Gina Dollar, the set of Gina Dollar is um, increased suburbs on Balkan, and majority of the seat is in the region of Balkan. But for the Balkan party, on its stands in Gina Dollar. And on the other ma on the other party with this um video talking about um because is is a high vote set compared to the other man parties. But back to the results. Boko party got four thousand eight hundred and eighty three votes. Um nine point nine nine point two percent the vote share zero point six of a quarter, and not contest the last election in twenty sixteen got a string towards the Boko party of nine point two percent. See of coin zone, um, Labour got eighteen thousand one hundred and seventy two votes. Vote share of forty eight point four percent. A quarter of 2.3 of a quarter and a swing against the Labour Party in Koinong of 0.1% is, is the same. The Labour Party got 12,673 votes, 26.7%. The votes are in Koinong. Quarter of 1.6 of the quarter got a swing against the Labour Party is 4.3%. The Greens got 11,114 votes. Um, vote set of 23.5%. Quarter is 1.4 of the quarter. Got a swing towards the Greens of 4.7%. Reading of the book. Mabichi, um, Labour got 18,539 votes. Vote share of 36.4%. Quarter of 2.2%. Got a swing towards Labour of, I write it down, 1.9%. For the Labour Party in Malbici, Malbici, um, is 17,869 votes. Votes are of 35.1%. 2.1 of a quarter and a swing against the Labour Party of 7.7%. .7%. For the Greens, the vote is 667 votes, 11.9%, and they got 0 0.7 of a quarter and they got a swing towards the Greens of 1.3%. Yeah, B. Um, Labour got 17,123 votes, 34.4%. Um, 
the quarter is 2.1 of a quarter and a big swing against the Labour Party in the RB of 9.5%. The Labour Party got 20, 27 and 28 votes. Um, vote share of 40.3%. They got 2.4 of a quarter and a swing towards the Labour Party of 4.4%. For the Greens, they got 5,110 votes, vote set of 10.3%, got 0 0.6 of a quarter and a swing towards the Greens of 3.2%. Um, that is the result of the ACT election um, for, for Friday. Could change. Um, soon is not not 100 percent counted yet um but um my thoughts of the act um the 2020 act election is somewhat predictable if you not from australia canberra and the australian capital the most um put static um Terribly in the country, and they got New Zealand, the left of centre vote, New Zealand holds office in Canberra or the Australian capital. This election is, and is not surprising with a Labour Green, is a Labour Greens coalition government in the ACT. Oi. A minority Labour Greens minority government. Oh, sorry for missing my words up, but um, that is the outcome. Um, um, why I got a swing towards the Labour Party in the RB because. Um, the leader of the Labour Party, as I call come he seat is there be and got a um, got a above normal swing at the last election in Yabi because the Labour Party promising and and built now the light wire from Gangalan to Civic and the result a Um, nine point five percent swing against the Labour Party, with a four point four percent swing towards the Labour Party. Somewhat predictable in Yabi, with the leader of the Labour Party is in the seat of Yabi and a big swing back to the normal result in Yabi. Um, for the city of Bimbabala, um, is somewhat of a surprise with a strong labor vote because um, it is a Labour Party stronghold. Um, the Labour Party holds have before the election. The Labour Party holds three seats in Bimbabala and. The vote just fall down, and the labor coming come in first place. Um, um, don't know the issue. Um, properly. Um, not in generally got major bus fires heading towards the southern south of Canberra and maybe the voters choosing um, um, the Labour Party more on the environmental record or the promising the light rail 
to wall then is just outside of the city of Bimbabala but the long term plans, the the ACT government, the Labour Greens government wanting to build the light rail to Tagalong in the future. Maybe that is the reason of got a big swing towards Labour and the Greens. And partly why got a swing of 5.7% of the vote in the city of Bimbabala is um, at the last election in 2016, the sex party contest, the Bimabala and the Green Party Josh Club sets in Bimabala and back to get the sex party um, not contest since election, most of the voters go back to the Green Party in the city of Bimbabala. Um, for Jinadala, um, it's um, hard to say. Um, the Boko Party, the leader of the Boko Party, Bill Sinagunot, had been um, the former leader of the opposition and the former um, leader of the Labour Party, he set up a new political party, the Boko Party, and why well, got a big string away from the Labour Party in Jinadala because the Labour vote choosing Boko Party land um land the Labour Party and. Let's look. Um, I just look on um Anthony Green's um election website, and it is um just the Labour Party just may return a second MP in Jinadala, but it is close between the third Labour and MLA Golden Ramsey and Peter. Chen or Ken um, from the Labour Party, but it's really close and similar to Ben Babala, um, the Labour, Third Labour candidate and the First Green candidate um, is neck and neck, and the Labour Party um, decide the preferences in the city of Ben Babala for the final fifth seat. But, um, back to Bimabala, but for Koenjong Resort is, um, is that is a somewhat of a great resort for the Greens, the gaining to see in Koenjong. Um, both are the leaders, the Labour Chief Minister, Andrew Barr and the leader of the Greens, Sam Wemmany, come from the city of Koyong. And the Liberal Party uphold the Greens, but with more left-wing parties, more left-wing mind parties and the Sopers, remaining Sopers, will elect the second Greens candidate. Um, in the city of Kornong, but it's um, somewhat of a um, interesting result, the most left-wing seat in the ACT. Um, city of Malbriti, Malbriti, um, somewhat of a um, Surprise resort, um, Labour coming first place and Labour's got a big string against the Labour Party. Um, at the last election in 2016, um, the former, um, the leader at that time, Jeremy Hansen, 
Um, he's, um, Dotsy is his. He's on seat and got a swing towards, I think got a swing towards the Liberal Party in 2016. And why got a, a large swing against, um, the Liberal Party because Jeremy Hansen is not the leader right now as a call. Um, the leader of the Liberal Party at the 2020 ACT election. And, and, you know, somewhat the Greens holding the own vote. Um, Karen Lukuka retiring in Mabichi and the news, new Green candidate, um, elected again. In the Peers Parliament, um, Labour got 12 seats, Labour's got 11 and Green's got 2 and CIS, Alex and Labour on track having only 10 seats, um, maybe 11. The Labour Party is definitely 8 seats and maybe 9 seats and the Greens Definitely five seats and maybe the sixth seat if the if the Green Party wins the seat of Bimbabala. But uh this election is um somewhat predictable but um see when I do the twenty twenty Queensland election. Um thank you for watching my video um see you the next time maybe do more mental health videos in the future thank you oh sorry if i misspoke it um she is this video is not adding at all and i could miss up the words but um that's that and thank you for watching my video. See you the next time.